So, you know, we live in a crazy world where you'll go into a gym and people will go to the gym five days a week or they'll pay for fitness classes and they'll push themselves and they'll have no physical change. And that physical change then leads to a mental, you know, you know, they don't see the results of all their hard work. And what's the actual root cause of that is because they don't have the discipline. They don't have the habits. They don't have what 80% of the equation is, you know, 20% of it is training. 80% of it is nutrition. You sleep well, your water intake. And I always tell people it's a hundred percent mindset. So I find a lot of self-sabotage and then people are constantly stuck on this hamster wheel, you know, Monday to Friday or Monday to Thursday, they're locked in. And then Friday and Saturday nights, they go out, they party, they let go of this discipline and then they step on a scale Monday morning and they're the same weight. And they do that for a year, two years, three years. And you say, hey, you know, you see it, you see the person in the gym every morning or every evening and they look the same. And it doesn't take that long to get results if you actually have a very disciplined system in place. Um, so I just feel a lot of self-sabotage. We're usually our worst enemy, uh, no one else. How long does it take uh, in terms of uh, sticking with something with, with with the people you work with until it becomes something that they're not going to stop and start doing like how long do people need to give themselves to be to stick to something before they they just stick with it for good uh, 90 days so I work with my clients from 90 days three months to six months but I would say three months and uh, you have to make a new person right you have to be a new person with a new mindset because i don't know if you read the stats but it's like oh, all the people that go on the biggest loser and follow diets they end up gaining back the weight and you ask yourself well why do they do that why do they gain back the weight because they're not the person that can walk around at that weight that weight is something that they will power they're gritted their teeth and they got to oh i'm gonna lose 20 pounds i did it for two three months i lost 20 pounds and then when that finish line was achieved, for some reason, they were going on vacation, they had to get into a wedding suit, whatever their journey was to lose 20 pounds, once they've achieved that, they always add it back on because they did it incorrectly. They looked at this as like a journey of three months, of six months. No, this is a lifelong journey. And you have to change the person you are and live life a certain way. So when you do hit that goal, you can maintain it for the rest of your life. Because I always tell people, you failed actually if you you know lost weight and you gain it again. All you've done is really just given yourself a little bit of a serotonin release, dopamine release when you're hitting that goal. But the way you live life every single day, achieving that goal and maintaining it should be easy. But usually it's not because they go back to their old habits.